Yeah. <laughs> 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 the table saw that just can do very precise work, you know. That's Marcus. He's also Austrian. Oh, really? Yeah. But we didn't know each other in Austria. <laughs> <laughs> even, though, even though he only grew up like 30 miles or so. Away That's from awesome. The, and yeah, it's the same, same language. I mean, the official language is German, but we have very strong dialects. Yeah. Mm -hmm. like, uh, it's almost, I mean, it, it goes back to being a different language. Germanic, but not pretty German. So, uh, but here I can show you some things over here. So there are more wooden pipes here. See, they're all they're much narrower than those other ones you saw in there in the other place. The way the way uh, these windchests work, so this is a place where pipes get set, and that's where they're going to be at home when they're installed. Uh, so each row like this is a note, particular note, one after another, and this going this way is the stop, you know, the row of pipes. So these things here, solenoids are going to, when you pull a stop at the console, it will move the slider and the slider has the holes, they either line up and it's on or they don't line up and then it's off. And these are screwed on, so I can't show it. Uh, but anyway, it's, um, it's so the wind will come through here, there will be a pipe here, there will be a different kind of pipe here, and each, each of these represents one stop. Mm -hmm. And these are pedal chests, so they're going to be played by the feet. And then over there, there are a whole bunch of chests here that are for the rest of the organ that we haven't put together yet. So is all of this in... is all that German? Yeah, um, a lot of... Um, a lot of language internationally uh, in, in organs is German. Because that's where the really famous composers you know, the Merkel, like Bach, Fuchs de Rode, and Mendelssohn, all these people. And so these are, so the first time you're using these motors, they are called intelligent motors. They can detect friction. So because, you know, we, we deliver this to Minnesota, it's super crazy uh, climate there, winter to summer, you know, very different. So, because everything is made out of wood, so things can change, of course. We try to, of course, make it so it does not change, or change as little as possible. But anyway, so there are, there are these compensators in here, like seals, uh, telescopic seals. But anyway, these, when they detect hard uh, or light, they will adjust the force automatically. Which is really good, because when you have if you, sw you can switch, let's say, 30 of them on all at once, and it's bang, you know, it makes this when they all go at once. And it's, and it's really hard to get the right balance, you know, between them working properly and not making too much noise. You know, so. so these, uh, I'll be curious to see how that works. So they should be very smooth because they'll only use what they need and go, go to the ends to one side or the other just especially towards the end you know, <coughs> I think slow down these are all milliseconds stuff you know, just, because have these you have, used these before not or? this not this particular brand I mean the brand yes but not this model it's just brand new it's called a proportional something you know proportional <laughs> um, um, magnet or solenoid uh, because of the process or stuff that's on there that mm -hmm. can do of course, there's another process of the computer where, where all the information comes from to there. So what are all these names here? Uh, so these trumpet names are all trumpet. So we, so we I use the language that the style we are working in. So this organ is a very eclectic organ. So this is French for trumpet, trumpet. Posaune, that's German for a 16 foot for a trombone. And Posaune has, uh, that's a 32 and this is a 16. Octave just refers to the, uh, to the principle here. This, this is the octave of this as a separate stop. And then over here, viola, that's a string. Uh, you know, 
point sixteen is also a string, and then principal principal we call the most typical organ type there is is a principal, it's, which is uh, like the ones that you see on the outside of the organ. Which are, they are they're not a string, and they're not a fl flute is wider. The string is narrower, and they are sort of in the in the middle, and there is nothing really. It doesn't really imitate anything. It's really a mm -hmm. strictly organ sound. So the diameter of the pipe affects the sound and the length affects the pitch? That's right. All yeah. right. Mm -hmm. So the length is... Uh, so tuning is a very simple thing. You know, people always say, oh, I don't have an ear for tuning. There's not much to do with the ear, really. You know, the actual finding the beat and tuning them so that there's no beat, you know. Just yeah. So it's, it's just... Uh, you just have to listen for that beat. And count it, you know, and then there is no more beat than it's in tune. <laughs> <laughs> so, <clears throat> if you, <clears throat> excuse me, <clears throat> if you have an organ that you tuned inside at a certain temperature and you take it outside and it's cooler, what happens to the. Well, the, uh, so all the majority of the pipes, which are the blue pipes, like the business, the one that I made, mean, those. Um, they, they work on the air, you know, principle. So it's an air column. So as long as the air is the same temperature, even though, I mean, even, but changing up and down, uh, everything will stay in tune. The pitch changes of the whole organ. So yeah, that's the, what uh, I meant. The pitch changes, changes the but they, yeah. changes, the whole but they organ stay stays within in each tune. Other, with each other, they stay yeah. in tune. Yeah. The only exception is the reed pipes, you know, because they are, that's not, there's a vibrating part, so that's why a clarinet, for example, is not so much affected by temperature, mm -hmm. just slightly, mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> or, or a trumpet, you know. But uh, an air instrument that works on this principle, this one, you know, they are, yeah. like a uh, flute. But on the flute, of course, the player compensates constantly, you know, for the pitch in case something changes. Um, but the reeds, they, they kind of stay more at the same pitch, and that's why when we go to tune an organ for a concert, we only tune the reeds that actually stay in tune. But they have to be adjusted to everything else because it's too much work to do mm -hmm. with flues, and then we destroy the pipes, we be tuning them along. We can't find some reeds. <coughs> So we have one other room over there where we have all lots of little parts and